Hi, my name's Hannah. I'm an online English tutor and doctor from the UK. Today, I would like to help you pronounce some of these tricky words which a lot of students have problems with. First one, systole, diastole, asystole, syncope. Now, if these pronunciations come as a surprise to you, that is because these words all come from Greek, so they don't follow the usual pattern of English pronunciation. So let's go through these again. Systole, that literally just means to contract. For example, during systole, blood is pumped from the ventricles into the aorta and pulmonary arteries. Diastole means to expand, so it's that period of time between contractions. So, in diastole, the ventricular chambers fill with blood. Asystole. A is put in front of Greek words to mean without. So, asystole, without contraction. For example, the patient has been in asystole for the last 10 minutes. The heart has not been beating for the last 10 minutes. And finally, syncope. This literally means to cut short. And it's generally used to mean what we can call a simple faint. So when due to vagal stimulation, the heart doesn't pump enough blood to reach our brains and we fall over. For example, syncope is more common in pregnancy. So I hope that's cleared up these tricky to pronounce Greek terms that we will find in our cardiology textbook. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Let me know if there's anything else you'd like to see in the comments and check out some of these videos that are popping up around the place. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel for further medical English videos. Thanks, bye.